Now, when we talked about the path yesterday, when we talked about keeping that path straight, if you took a look at verse six, you will see there's a word in there that most people don't like to hear. Most people don't want to put their arms around, and that word is the S word. The S word is submit. Submitting is something that we do for others. Sometimes we have to submit to our spouse. Sometimes we have to submit to our boss. Sometimes we have to submit to someone that we may not want to submit to. And in this case, the person that we don't want to submit to many times is God. We have an agenda. We have a way that we want to do things. We have our own thoughts and our own mind on how we expect God to act. And yet in verse 8, it tells us that when we submit and we stay on the path, that it will bring health to our bodies and to our bones. It will bring us the very life that we all desire to have through God. See, this path that we're taking is God's path. In your life, where is it that you have strayed from the path? Where is it you've strayed and gone your way and not God's way? Where is it you've taken a shortcut? Where is it you've said, you know what, this is the best thing for me and God is not in those choices? See, there are many areas that we can stray and many areas that we can leave the path. But ask yourself this question, is this really what God wants for you? Is this really what God wants for me? And ask yourself this question, what path am I following and what path do I want to follow? Because tomorrow's subject, you're not going to like very much. But you know what? It's something that we have to deal with. We'll talk about that tomorrow.